What is up, YouTube? Sean here, and I hope you guys are sweet. Welcome back to episode three of Detective Fridays. And in today's episode, I'm gonna show you guys how to use custom icons and third-party widgets on any iPhone running iOS 14 and above. After almost a year using uh, a Samsung Galaxy smartphone, I've finally decided to go back to iOS for some reasons I won't mention in this video. And um, there is a few things that I just didn't feel comfortable using on this brand new iPhone, like their icons. I know how Apple likes to brag about how good their icons look, but uh, to be honest, from a UX UI perspective, I really think it's true because they just colorful and huge and not minimalistic. And I mean, you know, everything minimal just looks good. So in today's episode, I'm gonna show you how to set up these custom icons I've decided to put together for you. I will leave a link, a download link in the description uh, for all of you guys so that you can actually download these icons. But for now, let's just quickly jump in the video and set up uh, our custom icons. All right, so first thing that we need to do is to uh, change our wallpaper and use a dark theme minimalist wallpaper. I'm gonna link, leave a link to this wallpaper in the description as well. Yeah, so let's just quickly go to our settings. On our settings, uh, let's look for wallpaper. And our wallpaper, go choose wallpaper. So choose the wallpaper that you want to use as a home screen wallpaper. You can also set it up as your lock screen wallpaper. So for this, in this, in this case, let's go choose this wallpaper and set. So you can set it for both. I'm gonna set it both. And once we're done with that, we need to go and look for uh, the shortcut application. It's right here. So we're gonna add every application icon, every custom application icon as a shortcut, you know. So all the applications that you want to use custom icons on, you need to set them up as shortcuts. So open your shortcuts application and go to the plus sign right on top right. Add action, scripting, and open up. So choose the app that you want to use uh, or the, the one that you want to customize. And uh, in, I'm gonna start with my YouTube music app and then go on three dots here on top right option and add to home screen so clear this new shortcut and uh, click on the icon go choose the file so once you download uh, the uh, icon pack that i'm just gonna link link up in the description you need to uh, save it in your files so save it in your files on your phone so i'm gonna choose the application for my music which is the music app icon and add so you click down here, so you, then you next put the shortcut name, YouTube Music. Then you're done. So if you check on your home screen, YouTube Music is added as a shortcut. So if you open, you actually open YouTube Music using a custom icon. So we're gonna drag and drop this in our uh, bottom bar let's do this for uh, the other applications that we need to customize and uh, when we're done we we'll move on to the widgets all right once we're done adding our icons our custom icons the next thing that we need to do is to go open our app store and uh, download the application uh, called uh, Zen Flip Clock. Right, so once we have Zen Flip, Flip, Clock, Flip Clock, we can just set up okay. I mean, everything is fine, but let's remove it from the home screen. And uh, long press on the home screen, click on the plus button on your top left corner and uh, to add widgets, look for uh, the Zen Flip Clock. Under Zen Flip Clock, choose the medium widget and add widget. So as you can see, it adds the widget right on top. So I click done. And then the next thing that we need to do is to also add some of the Apple widgets like the, let's go here, the battery life, battery life widget. Then we can add the battery life widget. 
but drop it down here and lastly we can add uh, the Apple TV widget because I like using Apple TV a lot so drag drop and done all right if you've enjoyed the video you know what to do guys don't forget to show some love but until next time stay blessed